Ladies and Tech. This video is going to be a continuation from the lecture that we had on the move instruction. So in the lecture we had this sample. The sample was a small a sawmill produces 2x4s and 2x6s that are being packaged on the same line. When the 2x4s are being packaged, there will be 400 boards in a stack. When 2x6s are being packaged, there should be 250 boards in a stack. The counter on the packing line must be set according to the product that is being packaged. So now we're going to take this and I will show you how to implement this logic into RS Logix 500. Alright, so we downloaded the program into the controller. You can see right now the preset on this counter is zero. So an accumulated value is zero. So the counter is done as we speak. What I want to do is that we're going to say there's two by fours have been selected to package on this line. So when I select by pushing this push button here, the, Q, or the value for our preset should change to 400. So I'm going to show you that now. And there you can see the preset at that counter up has changed to 400. If I select my 2x6s, 250 gets placed into that preset for that counter. So there you go, nice and simple, just to change the preset of a counter. You can do it with a timer. You can do it with uh, other instructions where you need to actually move data into one place or another. So if you have any questions or concerns, please post them below and make sure to please subscribe so that you can stay along with me and learn how to use PLCs in the program and a lot of logic. Thank you.